Hey guys, it's Sunday in the morning. Hey, subscribe so you can be my new day. Hey, hey, uh, ha, 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 ha. Before we get into the video, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, of course, and turn your post notifications so that every time I upload, you get the notification. Sorry, I've been in my head, but I will be coming back eventually. But make sure you click the link in bio and subscribe to my second channel because I am more active on there and get super. I know a lot of y'all have been asking what wig that I have on in that Snapchat and in my Instagram pictures. And it's this one. It's a little bit crusty now because I wore it already. But I didn't record when I put it on. So I'm going to do a video for y'all today so that y'all can know about the wig and stuff like that. This wig is from Eunice Hair. Eunice. I'm not sure how you say it. Eunice. You know. This is the wig that it comes with. I mean, this is the wig that it comes with. This is the box that it comes in. And thank you to Eunice Hair for sponsoring this video because... Y'all came through and that's on period. All I want to say though, for free, even though it's sponsored, y'all know I'll be telling the truth and I give my honest opinion because what are you going to do, kill me? No. Cool. So, um, one thing I will say though is I have gotten a handful of wigs by now. And this, my friend, this wig is soft. Like, when I tell you soft, bro, soft. But yeah, like, I'm not one of those people that's going to DK lie just because I'm getting sponsored. No. They didn't sponsor me to get a good review. They sponsored me to just review it. So, technically, you know, nah, but for real though. Nah, this wig is dumb soft though. It's it's a little bit frizzier now because I wore it and I was all over the place. So, excuse it looking like that, but this wig is so beautiful. Look at it. Like, I like the, um, I like the, like the street looks, like the colors. I love it. And I didn't even, um, bleach the knots when I wore it. So, like, that's why it looked like that. But it don't look bad though, look. I didn't even put concealer or nothing there, and it looked like that. But, um, I already cut the lace and wore it, like I said. So, yeah, I'm going to put this on again, just for the video, to show y'all. But, yeah, so I'm going to to put this on. Oh, uh, yeah, the wig is, I believe this was 26 inches, I believe. It's, I think it's 24. It's either 22, 24, or 26. I'm 4'11". I'm, like, 4'11", 5 foot, so, like, that's you could tell some down to like my butt so yeah and i am gonna be doing my videos with this because i like this wig a lot and i want to try to like style it like um i want to try to like uh what you call it like curl it and stuff so yeah now i look busted ah i know big forehead right don't care anywho um yeah so i'm about to try to gel this down which i already did it before but it came out a little bit so if y'all see any flakes coming down that's a gel how I do it is I take the equal side of gel because, you know, I don't got hair, so I can't braid it or anything. But how I do it is I take the gel and I put a lot of gel. Like, I basically gel it down, like, on some, a lot. But I don't really need to put no more on the rest of my hair because I already did that. This was the only side that came out because I started brushing with my fingers. But I will apply a thin layer over the rest of my hair. Excuse that little piece of like wig hair that's just there, like chilling, hanging. Yeah, I just noticed it. And this is not a tutorial because this is the first time that I actually did it right. So I don't know how to do this my damn self. But I'm just telling you how I did it. Yeah, so you just brush the hair back. Again, if you see anything, excuse it. That's from when I had the hair last time. Right now, after you put the gel and stuff, you get a do rag and you put the do rag on your head. So, I don't know what mine is. I don't know what the do rag is, so I'm gonna use this like little strip thing because I only got to take down this part, the front section. Everything else is already like flat because I did the wig before, like I've stated already. So, yeah, I'm just gonna tie this. And yes, I got a big forehead. I don't care, I, don't. I promise you, I don't. So, if anybody want to be like, oh my god, your forehead is big. Da -da -da -da. You damn right, and what, and what? You're stating an observation. That's not negative. Enjoy your day, beloved. Oh, I'm waiting for this to dry. You could blow dry with a blow dryer, but I'm gonna just talk real quick about um some updates, kind of. So yeah, I have a business. Um, these are some of my new products. These are you see them? Well, this is a lot of them, but I can't show y'all right now. But yeah, basically. But yeah, so basically, it's like a travel size, like a little reusable spoolie. It's pretty cute. You know, you just open it, pop it out. So you got the little gem. You know, you could do whatever you want. My mom, what she used this for is she put a little bit of um hair, not hair glue, 
she put like carrot oil and stuff in this and then she used it as like an eyelash serum or eyebrow serum or egg serum you know so feel free to do whatever you want with this but yeah this is it and i will be selling different tubes now i have lip oil tubes and i have these nice little pink ones um i also i'm going to i changed my squeeze tubes from 10 milliliters to 15 milliliters so oop. and also my um sugar scrubs come in this little individual packing and i also got business cards that i made i didn't make the business cards i made i made the graphic design for them i also have lashes which um i didn't change the tray yet so like don't mind the tray but these are my lashes for now they're 9.99 so yeah but i think i'm gonna go in and individually curl each lash with an eyelash curler just to make it more you know like because i like eyelashes that are you know so yeah but these are the eyelashes it's a magnetic case um and here's my um my business card i made it myself um i used pixart to make it and i printed it from visa print um i think i'm gonna do a dedicated video to like business and stuff like that if y'all want that but yeah so this is my card it's honey gypsies and bali one the back just has the website and my instagram yeah i've got 500 for i think 30 dollars i think i'm gonna be coming out with um those little bags of like because i have a bunch of lashes that are different than the ones that are in the case they're a little bit more cheaper so i'm gonna do those eyelash packaging bags like where they have like candy the scrunchies eyelashes lip gloss i'm gonna do all of that so that's coming soon but yeah so make sure y'all follow my business page on instagram honey Gyp season um honey Gyp SZN. i'll put it somewhere on the screen and follow my regular instagram page at the real alina Moni, and let's get me to 21k sometimes the hair comes with they come with wig caps but i bought a pack of um wig caps anyway so yeah it comes with wig caps it comes with the clasps it comes with um i think extra comb and stuff like that it comes with a lot of things so now you take your cap and you apply it to your head and you stretch it down now when you stretch it down make sure you like do that if your hair short like mine because my hair be flop falling down but if you have braids it's not gonna do that anyways i'm gonna keep this down because because i said so oh also i forgot to tell you i recorded a video of me trying to do a wig like two weeks ago and i edited it but i'm waiting for the company to review the video before i post it so yeah if y'all see that and it's terrible that's why anyway so you gotta put this on your hair man oh i forgot to wait a minute when you put it down um just cut little holes for your ears again this is not a tutorial i'm just telling y'all what i do because i trust me y'all know i was sucking for the longest so oh my god my eyes look like that it's because it's mad this thing is thick anyways yeah so i'm gonna just put it down so i don't do that and just put this on your edges on your hairline Right, now that it's on there just take your blow dryer and blow dry it so i'm gonna do that and i shall be back and you gotta blow dry it so it's dry dry so it's like rock solid so yeah now it's not all the way dry but blow dry it so it's all the way dry i just need this on my face also make sure you blow dry it on cool so um yeah but you see how right there it doesn't really look like anything's there yeah no you don't want that put some there once you see it like that, and then just blow dry it. But yeah, like I said, um, I'm not really doing this to go anywhere. I'm only doing this to show y'all what I did and to talk about the wig and stuff like that. So, you know. Also, I don't have little scissors. That's why, like, I'm using these big scissors. All right, now what I'm gonna, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take some of my finger and run it across the edge. But this part, I only, I, I'm only doing this because I've seen a lot of people do it. So you know, I need to pull. Oop! I need to pull this part back a little bit. There you go. 
that's fine like that because it's not really going to be out like that anywho so yeah when you do this you need to get the um those right out because it will make your cap lift and you don't want that that's what i learned the hard way so you take the bubble out so once you do that you take your makeup and you put it on um, the way I do it is I put it all over my hair. I just put it on the hairline and then on the middle because that's where I'm going to have to part at. So, you know. And this is probably not even the best match for me, but whatever. And my my wig cap could definitely be laid down better. But like I said, I'm not going anywhere. So it's not that much of a, you know, ah. So. Yeah, I didn't bleach the knots of the wig, by the way, like I stated before. So, that's why I put um, foundation in the, I mean, concealer in the middle part. Now, with that being said, um, you can also, what I've seen people do is they take the lace, like you see that I did, put the concealer on the lace, like around the edges and right here, and then spray with a little bit of got to be spray, so I can lock it in, and that helps give it like a, um, whatever that's called. Yeah, that's what I've seen. So now I'm gonna go in with a thin layer of Got To Be Glue. Cause I don't have the wig glue and this works fine. I'm going with a thin layer. Thin, but not too thin, you know. Also, if this doesn't look the best, it's all right because we all start somewhere. And same thing for y'all. If y'all do a wig and it don't look the best, don't be discouraged. It's okay. Because I was very discouraged and I didn't want to do it no more. Okay. My wig just flipped upside down. Oh, oh. <laughs> now, that's one good thing about this hair is that no matter how many times you flip it, it's still max off. You just need a good brush and that's it. Now that it's tacky, you take your wig or whatever, and you know, if the lace isn't cut, you cut the lace. Well, honestly, 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 I don't, I'm not a wig person and stuff, so like the things I do might not be normal, but I like to cut the lace before I put it on because of the simple fact that when I put the lace, when I put it on, I don't know, but it works for me, so that's all that matters, you know. You feel me, baby? No, you stop. Let's go for it, though. All right, now you take your wig and you're gonna put it on your head, but not all the way yet. Just make sure it's on the back. Clip it in. Then you take the wig and you're gonna bring it forward, right? Uh-huh. You bring it forward, grab the lace, if I could find it. Got it, and you bring it forward. And then you gotta just hold it for a second so it could kind of just stay in place for a second. Just so it could like stick there for a second. Oh, you see? Oh. See that? Okay. See? Now, this is not the best I've done, but it is on there better than anything y'all have seen. So, you know. Just make sure it's on properly and what you gotta do is you gotta um get like a wrap or something to put it on there but i didn't i don't think i brought it all the way down so that's why it looked like that but that's fine now what you're gonna do after that take the bows off like i said i'm in a rush and i'm not wearing this wig so yeah but um that's like the basic of how i did it and it's not the best but i am a beginner like i said and yeah, so you know, you could do your baby hair, you can go ahead and fix it up. So, but I am gonna insert videos and pictures. See, look at that, look at that, look at that. And mind you, it literally fell on the front, yeah. So, all of that, so so to a nice here, my baby. Nah, for real though, like this wig is so fire. And imagine with some curls and stuff, oh, I will be starting this soon to show you some styles and stuff, but um. Yeah, um, oh, let me show y'all the length of it, though. Alright. It's on my butt. 
<laughs> it's down my butt. <laughs> but yeah, like I said, I'm 4'11", so I'm like 4'11", 5 foot. So if you're around that, um, that, uh, height, then yeah, you'll see how it is. But yeah, this wig is so soft and beautiful. Like, if y'all yeah, yeah, probably could see how soft it is. And I didn't even put anything in it or nothing. I just been on the phone like, that. Stiff wear, stiff wear, stiff wear. And I'm just like, yeah, like, you know, and if you throw on some lashes, it's so fire. I'm going to insert the videos I took. And yeah, so you see. Hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, of course, and turn on your post notifications so that every time I upload, you get the notifications. And if anybody has any business inquiries, my email is in the description box. If you want to see the link to the to this wig and you want the information, description box, link to my other channel, description box, everything's in the description box. Leave a comment, like, all that, and I love y'all, and yeah. So, for everyone that's asking, this is the Marvelous wig, and I will do more videos on it, on styling it, and stuff like that. And yeah, so honestly, I do recommend though, because I really do like this wig. It is so loved. It is totally, this company, Unice Hair, Unice, Unice, I don't know how you say it, but yeah, it's really nice, so... Bye.